let's see what Pietro just did. So you can see on the left hand side of the software we have this database structure which contains the, the, uh, the exercises that were just carried out. And if we simply just plot them, you can see uh, all the various exercises. And you can see information such as the vertical acceleration, uh, the bottom curve, the velocity curve, that will be the middle one, and the displacement curve, that will be the top one. We can uh, superimpose accelerations. Let me just zoom in on, the, on this tab. That's acceleration, velocity, and displacement. So you can see these are the accelerations, the velocities, and the displacements of all five uh, jumps that were just carried out. You can observe um, just by looking at the curves that more or less Pietro jumped in the same way all five times. Now why don't we go and compare the various parameters that are available for these exercises. Let's just push the compare exercise button. And we have this nice window that opens, which contains numerical information. You can see the columns contain all the different variables available, and the rows would have the different exercises that were carried out. This same information can be viewed in graphical form by simply clicking exercise graphs and selecting the kind of uh, the, the parameter that you want to uh, plot. So this is, for example, flight time, and this is what we're looking at is the maximum velocity and etc. Okay, 